Welcome back to Realistic Fishing. Well, it rained all night. The water is super muddy. There's quite a bit of current in this little creek. This is when fishing is tough. We're gonna try live bait, bobber and a worm. Let's see if I can find anything at all. Some people don't even bother fishing in conditions like this. But for some people, the time you have is the time you have. Let's get a worm on here, see if I can find anything. Man, this is like chocolate milk. Got a size eight hook here. Good old trusty red worms. Let's see what we can do. Let's let it just drift in the current. See if anything picks it up. My bait is caught in the current. Look at it getting swept away. I guess I'll move down that way just a little bit. See if that helps. Maybe down here. Hopefully I can find something, anything. It's swirling around in here like a washing machine full of chocolate milk and brand cereal. So let's get the hell out of here. Let's go try somewhere else. I'm not sure where I can go where it won't be muddy, but I guess we'll check a couple spots. Well, let's see if I can catch anything over here. All the rain from last night is washing that mud off the bank and into the creek right here. And it's trying to push its way out to the main lake. I'm trying to avoid that muddy water. So let's see if this cove over here looks any better. Let's get our worm out here, see if we can find anything. And I mean anything. I think I got a stick or something. Well, that was the first catch of the day. It came flying off. Now my line's all tangled up. Let's see if we can get this untangled. Almost. There we go. There's a little bite. Take it. Take it. Oh, missed him. Something had it. Tried to take it under anyway. Got that one. Let's see what I got. Doesn't feel very big, but I am happy to have anything at all. There we go, bluegill. Not too bad. Muted colors. Kind of a light purple and cream, maybe a little pink or orange. Good looking fish. Still got my bait, let's keep going. My bobber's not quite sitting right. I might be tangled up a little bit. I think I am tangled up. There we go, I saw it come undone.
there's a bite. Got him. Another bluegill, I'm guessing. Doesn't feel very big. Very similar to that other one. Good looking fish though. See if I can get my worm on here a little better so the next fish doesn't just steal it right away. Those are not bad, but I'm hoping we can do better. But, you know, with these water conditions, I am not complaining one bit. Oh, damn it, I hesitated. Let go of it by then. We'll see if he comes back. Might have stole my worm. Got him. All right. This one feels a little better. Or I have a stick or some weeds or something with him. Oh, here we go. Very similar to those other ones. This one's a little bit bigger, probably in that six inch range. Same color as those other ones, that kind of faint purple, cream, peach. All right, three bluegills. Let's keep trying. Wow, that's way over there. I can barely even see that because of all the goofy reflection. I think that's a bite. Got one. Way across on the other side. Doesn't feel very big. Let's see what we got here. Another bluegill. These could all be the same bluegill. It would be hard to tell them apart. They all have that same color pattern right now. Good looking fish though. I'm just glad I found some. Muddy day like this, sometimes you won't catch any. There's a bite. Come back for it. Come back, Shane. Is that a bite? Is that a bite? Got him. This one feels a little bit better. See what we got here. Another bluegill looks just like those other ones. This is a school of very similar colored bluegills. That one jumped out of my hand. Yep. Same thing. Let's keep trying though. You know, about 20 feet off the far bank is where I'm finding them. Just gotta find that spot. Keep fishing it. Launching it. All right. There's a bite. Got him. Oh, did he come off? No, he's still on there. Not very big. 
think I had a stick or something at the same time and uh, felt a lot bigger than it was. Just a little guy. Smallest one so far, you know, about a four incher here. Let's get back to it. Just one or two more, then I gotta go. Got him. All right, last fish of the day right here. Five inch bluegill. Yeah, that's too small to be the last one. All right, all right, one more. I gotta do better than that. One more. Always one more. Got him. All right. Last fish right here. I was looking up there to listen for that car burning out or whatever was going on. Didn't even see my bobber went under. Good fish here. This is a good one to go home on. Got a big fat belly on it. There we go. That's a nice one. We're going home on this one. Realistic bluegill on realistic fishing. All right, not half bad. What I thought was going to be a horribly slow, muddy water day turned out to be okay. I didn't get any fish in that first spot because it was just too muddy. But then when I came over here, I was able to find about a dozen bluegills, got them on a bobber and a worm. Anyone can do it. Thanks for watching Realistic Fishing. Keep it realistic.